It's the missing sealers. This is horrible. So he was behind this, huh? Messing with the sealers? Is Al out of his freaking mind? There are so many. Is he trying to create some kind of unsealable demon or something? That's quite an interesting theory, and certainly not impossible. Who are you? Odd, I was just about to ask you the same question. But no matter, I've never had a guinea pig come here willingly. Allow me to welcome you. Who the hell are you? And your body? I'm here for Alfred. What do you want from our master? You have no idea who I am, do you? Well then, it's time to act, right? Oh. Please excuse my unforgivable rudeness. You must be an ally of Sir Alfred. Nine? It's okay. I'm sorry for beating the crap out of you. So where is he? 
Actually, I'm not sure. But I'm overjoyed that someone of your power has decided to join us. The revival of the Formelio royal family is close at hand. And all of Sir Alfred's hopes. Please, do all that you can to help us. <laughs> His hopes, huh? Last I checked, Al was complaining about how religion did nothing but hope and pray. So much for his magical science. Hmm? Is something the matter? Of course not. Go on, keep talking. Yes, well, as I was saying, after all these years, Sir Alfred's dream will come true. And since our hopes are one and the same as his, we are overjoyed. The time has come, and we will soon achieve what we've all been waiting for. Please, you too must come with us and... This is lame. I'm gonna go ahead and crush that hope right now. Uh. Crazy fanatics. Now what was the point of that? Ah, I guess I should have pretended a little longer and gotten more info. But he was pissing me off. And that's reason enough to kill the only lead we had? This is a perfect example of what happens when an idiot tries to act clever. Oh, shut up. I just hate the idea that jerks like him are to blame for killing all those girls. So, what about you? What can you tell me about Alfred? The previous ruler of the Kingdom of Lorvin was shrewd and respected. He used Formival's power to create this demon factory. Because of that, the Kingdom prospered and all its citizens lived well. But of course, that was short-lived. An army built using Formival's power. So he sold the creatures to other kingdoms? Yep. But Arzalide, his younger brother, claimed it was completely unethical. It began as a feud, grew into a civil war, and ended when Arzalide killed his brother. Ironic that that's what it took to finally turn Lorvin into a peaceful society. Of course, they lost control of the demons, which are going after everyone now. A great king, and a respected person. According to some, yeah. A real tragedy, they said. Alfred was the son of the fallen king, and Arzalide's nephew. And it gets even better, being the great humanitarian that he was. The new king couldn't just exile or kill Alfred, so he adopted him. And you know the rest of the story. It's too crazy to call a tragedy. It's more like a bad comedy. So, now Alfred wants to take his place as the legitimate heir? Well, I hope that's all there is to it. <laughs>